human rights are enshrined in Chapter 4 of the Constitution, and they include reproductive health, which is a component of health rights. It is my hope that the collaboration that we are forming today with Haki Jami will culminate in the improvement in service delivery in our hospitals in regard to the reproductive health. Ladies and gentlemen, it is my belief that this partnership, which we are doing here today, will result in the formulation of reproductive laws and policies which will be in conformity with the Kenyan constitution. Ladies and gentlemen, again, we appreciate Haki Jami for championing for reproductive health and uh, we pledge our support as mandated by the constitution. We need to have a subsidized uh, health opportunity machine. As secretariat uh, of the committee for health, we shall continue relentlessly uh, support the committee for health and the county assembly at large in their endeavor to achieve uh, all these goals laid on the desk. Uh, so going to the MOU for today, uh, briefly, uh, it doesn't contain so much, but just a framework on how Hakijami and Mombasa County will work. And we are not just working on matters, reproductive health right or health alone, but we'll be working on issues, land, water, sanitation, issues of education, and also matters to do with land rights and housing rights. Because as we speak, housing agenda is one of the biggest agenda for this particular government. But how are the communities placed? How is Mombasa County benefiting? Who is managing these resources? Is it national or county government? And how will you do oversight role? It also breaks down our expertise as an organization. So what will Akijami bring on board? We'll be able to bring our expertise, which is legal, community engagement. We'll be able to create uh, quite a bit of awareness. We'll want to be part of your technical assistant team to be able to guide the various house committees on matters, policies, and particularly economic and social rights. And then again, we want to co collaborate and capacity build uh, both state and non-state actors. So we'll be able to share information together and remember that this MOU is just for four years, it can be reviewed. Today we are discussing about this scope, but two, three years we might want to expand or reduce.